what's going on guys this is wolf thorn gaming here thank you again for joining me on another video as you guys know it is thursday and it is time for us to throw it on back to a previous call of duty game and it also happens to be my birthday so i'm going to be celebrating it by doing a double upload this will be one of two videos that i release uh today the purpose of this commentary why i wanted to get on and even say a few things was to talk about black ops 1 backwards compatibility and where is it you know are we ever gonna get it is it just a myth and everything like that uh i love this game guys first of all first and foremost this happens to be one of my favorite call of duty games if not my favorite completely because it had everything man it was simple but not to the point where it was boring you know it had so much gun variety the kill streaks were perfect once you had that blackbird it was over and i went uh pretty good in this clip i think i went 27 and 5 at the end and i would have done much better if i didn't get outgunned just like you saw right there uh, i got to the chopper gunner but i was one kill away from the doggies couldn't get him so i just want to talk about what, a few things of what made this game special to me and uh yeah i just want to know where backwards compatibility is at i mean we've it, we've been hearing about it for weeks and weeks and weeks and months even uh, people have been saying that, I mean, if you check, people have been saying that they wanted this game for coming over backwards compatibility, but instead they'll release something that, you know, you've never even heard of before or something that you're not really that interested in. Uh, not, not, I'm not complaining, first of all. I'm definitely not complaining. Be, being able to use your old games uh, that you paid for on a previous system on the newer one is definitely... I, I plus definitely something that they don't have to offer but it's nice if they do i mean think even a company like nintendo that consistently gets you know pooped on they have ha they have backwards compatibility between the wii and the wii u so why couldn't you know xbox 360 and the one have that same feature but i'm not going to go ahead and talk about that kind of stuff that's the politics behind the systems and all that and that is not the purpose of my channel the purpose is to play some games and that is exactly what I wanted to do. I mean, I don't mind. I don't mind playing on my 360. Like that's not a problem. The problem is, it would be so much better to just be able to pop this game into my Xbox One and play with all those players who have been consistently voting for this game to come out. If you go on Xbox.com feedback or like Xbox.com and then go to the Xbox feedback section for backwards compatibility. You can see that the Call of Duties, the previous like Modern Warfare 2 and the original and Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 2, they are all at the top of the list uh, for people's desire of backwards compatible games. And as I get this SR-71 here, I told you, once you guys get the Blackbird, it is over. And here is where I'll just get completely wrecked. So this is what I was talking about, guys. Check it out here. Uh, it has been confirmed by... I guess an admin for Xbox that the game has been announced as an upcoming title for backwards compatibility and they will up update you accordingly if you leave your email address and what have you now it gives me a lot of hope to see that then maybe the our this game will definitely be coming to us uh, sooner than we realize but you know it has been eluding us for a while like they just keep saying yeah yeah it's coming out it's coming out it's coming out but it's not, and I have a feeling that the reason they're not doing this, they're not releasing it as backwards compatible, because, I mean, while Black Ops 3 is the current Call of Duty, and a lot of people would definitely, definitely be uh, playing that game still, I think a lot of players would definitely shift back to Black Ops 1 for that time, because this game was amazing. I mean, they're, like, I, like I mentioned to you guys before, it just had everything that I felt like a Call of Duty should, not to mention... It was boots on the ground, and it was just everything that a Call of Duty game should feel like. Uh, you know, with the whole talk about space warfare and all this stuff happening, where our franchise is going into a whole different direction that people may not exactly want. It's It would be nice to go back to play this kind of game to and not have to do it on a separate system because there are a lot of people who don't have their 360s anymore who weren't like me and decided to keep it or use it as a netflix uh box or youtube box whatever just to watch videos and movies and everything like that there are people who have sold it because you know they want 
to trade it in. And GameStop gets some credit towards their new system. They don't want to pay the full price, and they don't want to also clutter up their houses with the system behind. And that's the reason why a lot of people want Black, Black Ops 2 as a backwards compatible game, and Black Ops 1, Modern Warfare, and the list goes on, guys. There's so many things that I see you and me both have been voting for, and I really hope that this game comes backwards compatible very, very soon. But that about wraps it up for me here, guys. I really have nothing else to say about that. I hope that it's not a myth, and I really hope that that admin post on the Xbox feedback site where people have been voting is true, and they are definitely working on getting it to us. I don't know when, and I don't have any insider information or anything like that as much as I wish I did, but... I really hope, like I said, I just can't stress this enough, guys. This was one of my favorite Call of Duties, and I cannot wait to see what, if they bring it to us. I mean, the gun variety, the kill streaks, the maps, the the zombies map pack where we got every single DLC map r like remastered from World at War, the boots on the ground, the the amazing, you know, just the hit detection was kind of iffy. There, this game had its problems. But, it, I mean, no game is perfect, and I would just love to go back and be able to play this game whenever I feel like it on my new console with the new controllers and everything like that. So, thank you again. Also, Black Ops 3, Double Crypto Key Weekend. Get hyped, guys. The grind is real. It is happening. And I will see you then. Take care. Have a great night. And peace.